When Musrat Misbah visits her organization, smiles are on every face, and most of these faces are severely damaged. In the garden of the Defilex Smile Again Foundation, 40 women are waiting for her. All of them have undergone sulfuric acid or kerosene attacks. Most often, a husband or jealous lover threw the liquid on them or set them ablaze. Musrat founded her organization in 2003. So far, 600 victims were taken care of, and on each visit, she meets new ones. It normally takes some time for them to tell us the true story. So we don't kind of uh, force them to tell us now, you know. Today, eight Italian plastic surgeons arrived as volunteers. During one week, they will perform surgery on these burned women. And that is a long process. It takes an average 25 surgeries to reshape the faces as close to normal as possible. This young woman says she was burned as she cooked when her veil caught fire. But sometimes, the women lie about what happened. I hope that is the correct version of uh, the accident, the domestic uh, problem in Pakistan there is very much of this problem. I hope, but uh, I can't, I am not, <laughs> I am not a policeman. Compelled to lie, because some of them are still living with the man who ruined their faces. They have no choice. In some families, divorce is not an option. So one of the priorities was to make sure these women could support themselves. Now, a dozen of them work as beauticians in the Depolex salons, taking care of other ladies' beauty. They also take care of their own features. Thanks to this job, Uruj was able to leave her husband. I'm treated as a normal woman here, not a victim. When I walk in the streets, people look away from me, and each time, that hurts. Yes, we need medical care, but we also need cheerful words. This can happen to anybody here. It can happen to anybody. All the more so as in Pakistan, a bottle of sulfuric acid is only worth 20 rupees, that is, 20 euro cents. To give an idea of how damaging this liquid can be, just dip a match in it, it catches fire. On a face, a few drops, a few seconds are sufficient to cause irreversible harm, and psychological harm too. Many cases will never be registered, as some women feel too ashamed to ask for help.